Hi guys and welcome back to the show. We're playing Warhammer 40k Death Watch Tyranid Invasion. Um, so there's one good thing I really have to do at the beginning of this video and that is I have to rename one of my space marines because I said if you suggest some good names in comments I'm going to put them in. So it was Siebenzunden. Um, this is shout out to you. I hope I know it's German, I hope I pronounced it correctly, one, and I hope it's uh, not some nasty language, foul language, we don't understand. It's definitely not touched by the warp, as, as far as I can say. And for you who don't know, Siebenson is a great fan of um, Space Hawk 2, Vengeance of Blood Angels, great game. Uh, it came around 96, 95, somewhere around that time. So, he uh, suggests the name. Nathaniel for Sepharum Gulos uh, instead of Sepharum Nathaniel. Um, I'm really thinking about that. Um, and the reason I'm thinking about that is with the influx of new Space Marines I have received recently, I'm not sure Sepharum Gulos will be attending many of the missions. Uh, and I really want to honor my. Uh, promise and I really want to honor this activity and I think Nathaniel is a great name by Siebenzunden. So what I thought about is to rename Philo Fistfall because I think Fistfall is great, Philo is a bit phallic, right? Um, so and, and it's you know I never know what to say, Philo or Philo. So what I'm gonna do here and you let me know Siebenzunden is I'm going to rename File of Fistfall to Nathaniel Fistfall. And if that doesn't work for you, let me know. I'll change the names again, but uh, I want to be fair. But in all fairness, again, if I'm changing a Space Marine's names, uh, if I'm changing Space Marine's names, something uh, you suggested, I'd write it's, it's a character I use often and that is on display and that is seen very often. And, and File is definitely that guy. So. Here we go. I'm doing it. Oops. Nathaniel. Nathaniel, welcome to the team, brother. So, Nathaniel Fistfall, wearing uh, Glam's Plasma Gun, Glam's Fury, very very exciting. Um, if you hear some noises like clicking and everything, that's because I know this monster of a game has been overheating my iPad, but uh, I, I can't stop playing, I can't stop shooting the campaign for you guys, so I bought a Master Cooler U2 stand that uh, hopefully will take some of the heat away and allow us to enjoy the game without me being worried that the iPad is going to explode into my face from the fire great name for another episode so let's dive right into it with some new space marines Nathaniel Fistfall second from the left So let, let's do it. I don't think my loadout is optimal at the moment. I really feel like uh, I know not enough bullets, but I love these team members. So kill team, off you go. Uh, during the last mission, I got a new grenade. It was a I think frag grenade or it was a crack grenade or well, one of them. But my space marines have no slots to equip them, so. The Promethean has ignited and the base is burning. Detonation is imminent. The gunships cannot get any closer. Get to the new extraction site. Slay anything that stands in your way. So let's do it. Um, this place is starting to burn. 
So we really, really need to get out. Boom, 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 boom. Let's twist the map a little bit. Tilt it. Okay, how about this? Zoom in, right? So let's see how it works. Hopefully, um, the Cooler Master is great and uh, we can play it without being disturbed. So, you know, by now you know my routine, guys. I'm going to create a series of Overwatch and positions here. So that we're not bothered regardless where the Xenos might come in. Brother Zolpian again, uh, the way he, the way his dialogue is written in the game and interpreted, I think he's touched by, <laughs> I think he's touched by the warp. Uh, not nice of me to say so, but uh, I'm sorry, I, I just, I just believe it. He's, he's foul, <laughs> he's a demon. Oops. So, quite obviously, there are some danger zones we do not want to step into, no matter what. Um, they're actually indicated on the map by uh, this flickering red square so let's try and avoid them and you know on the other hand let's hope that the Xenos run into as many of them as possible Nathaniel. And although Nathaniel Gloss is great and Siebenzund and I know that goulash might be a food that is also served in Germany, um, Nathaniel Fistfall is just brutal. Here they come. Explosions. So we've uh, encountered the enemy. Let's talk. He stalks, right? Well, that's cheap, really. Like, to remain standing with this much health, completely cheap, it's... can't be, you know, inexcusable. Inexcusable. So, Helmar is going to make a comment on that. Yep. Point taken. So I'm, I'm a little bit worried about the positioning here. Some of the red circles, one of the red squares is right here, right at this spot. So um, 
I do want to make sure I avoid it. We got Zelpian here. What if... What if we run it a little bit? Ooh. Take a stride. We got Nathaniel here. Nathaniel. Uh, I need you to move as well. Let's hope for the best. I know, I hear you. Let's do it. Boom bada boom. So that's a Nathaniel dishing out vengeance. And the overheating is plasma cannon. So these guys are ready to tear me down. Oops, there's another one. So let's create some crossfire here. with the melt up might not have enough of reach but uh running Halmar let me risk it and uh, run him here but Rufus uh, is the right guy for a reach long range accurate and currently blocked. Blocked off by his peers. Boom. Ouch. Might as well we can deal with him. Leandros. I so need you to move closer, Leandros, but... Rufus comes first. Uh, grenade, any chance? Mm, unfortunately not. So I said that Siebenhunden. Sorry, not, not Siebenhunden. Uh, Siebenhunden. The person who suggested the name for Nathaniel Fistfall. It's from Germany, he might obviously be from any country, but Germany, Austria would be the most obvious um, tips. Um, I just want to apologize if I'm calling an Austrian German and vice versa. What to do, what to do. Well, getting closer to the freight has never hurt. Uh, 
Oh, yeah, I'm draws. He needs to get a little bit closer. He's in range now, but what I'm going to do is move him even closer. Put him on the overwatch. Because there's one more tyrant guard, remember? Nathaniel is going to kill this guy. I swear. See? I was right. Zalpian. He is a heretic. I'm telling you guys, you'll see. Oops. That actually hurt. And he's running away. More friends join the party. Just giving away free beer. Boom bada boom. So, so far I got lucky. Uh, I didn't get fried on any of these hot zones, but right now if I look at Lu Rufus, he's not in a good position, so I need to move him out. And he can't shoot anymore, but no, not enough distance for a grenade. Let's try to get closer. Um, throw. No chance, no chance, no chance, unfortunately. So, we got a bit of a situation here. Uh, there is an turn guard right there. So let's do this. Yeah, it's starting to get a little tricky. But uh, hopefully we can deal with it. I could actually hide this guy here. Yes, an overwatch. Ha <laughs> ha so very smart of me. Ultramarines are the masters of battle tactics, blah blah blah. So, the fun thing about ultramarines is, you know, that before the chaos got widespread, it was unthinkable for a space marine to be battling another space marine to a level where these guys would not even train fighting each other. They would not train in a simulator or anywhere. Um, but there was one captain, might have been Sergeant, but I think it was captain, who did train that and, and he was almost punished for that, but in the end it saved their asses, right? So, Ultramarines. Why don't we focus on the situation to the south, or well, one possible answer would be because we need to proceed, but why don't we focus on that situation and uh, just overwatch on the rest of the map. Let's go. And shoot him. Well, not what I meant. Guys, why didn't you stay for one more turn? Must have been Rufus. So currently on the map, a little bit more excitement than I would have asked for. We need to figure out how to deal with it. Two 
Too bad these guys moved out. So, what to do, what to do? First off, there's a guy we don't really like. Uh, there's many of them, but... Oops, there's uh, three more. I had no idea about that. If I could, I would have thrown the grenade. So obviously throwing a grenade doesn't cost any APs. That's great. So I need to move here. Shoot this guy. Do it again. Oh my god. Do you believe it? Move out of the explosion sword. No time for Overwatch, that's not ideal. Whoa. Bad dream. Bad dream. So let's overheat. On purpose. Here you go. How? Here you go, Nathaniel Fistfall is uh, one hit, one shot, one kill. I need to get rid of this guy, but uh, there's probably no way to do it. Leandros, in a very bad shape, um, health-wise. No idea what to do about it. Best I can do is I can um, move him so Helmer's body protects him, but uh, that's not ideal, right? Pew pew pew! You must be joking. Mm, a little bit too. A little bit more serious. Nicely done. So Helmer is a space wolf. Very, very tough guy. Things not looking good for Nathaniel. Things not looking good in general. Uh, I need to. I may need to replay this mission. Before I give up, um, there is still a chance to win, right? So let me check the health on Nathaniel. About 50%. Not good, not good. Get rid of the small guys. That was unnecessary. The explosion would have died for him, but uh, yeah, that might have been a mistake. Zalkin. I really need to purchase the healing ability that he has. But before that, the close combat ability that he excels at. I'll spawn. <laughs> I really think he's up. I'm sorry. So 
So, what to do, what to do. Got a lot of guys who need a little bit of help and healing. Elmar misses. Not confident enough to let uh, Leandros just run into there, but Nathaniel, awesome job there. And he still has action points left to go on an overwatch. Fantastic. Not so great. So, what do we do here? We got bad guys here. Grenade would have helped the situation, but we don't have that. I mean, Rufus has that, but... So let's start from south. No enemies there. So let's uh, clear out the way. And we're already dead, so we need to hide. Oops. One more step. Take it. Hmm. Too much in the open here, I would not be surprised. If this was a big mistake, double miss and no action points. So we gotta deal with these guys up there. Unfortunately, I don't feel that well about my health here with Leandros. And I did wish that Yalmar had uh, a grenade right now. Bad. Here we go, artillery ready. Okay, now please finish him off. Please finish him off. Yes! The Emperor attacks without any question. So, everybody's still alive, let's get moving. Oops, um, as if I encountered a bug here, I can't see the grid. See the bug? 
I have no idea where I can move or not. Move here? No. Is it really my turn? <laughs> Guys, there's a bug in here. I, uh... I know. Or... I might have just get, gotten confused, sorry. <laughs> Oops. Too bad. Your time will come. Ultramarines, regroup. Well, that was close. That was spot on. We saw damage indicator there, cost four damage. We really need to proceed here, we haven't covered much ground since the beginning of the mission, you can see it here, we're still in the first third. Very tactical, but also very tiring, we're starting to run out of um, action points. Boom boom bada boom by Nathaniel. Now let's, let's do something else here. Peekaboo! Worked great. We got a watch here. I really need some healing in this game. Wait, wait, that was a mistake. There is an explosion. I don't know if uh, the Helmar seems to be out of it. Do I want to risk it? No. So let's change the plans. Hmm. No time left for Overwatch. We're going to move Rufus out of harm's way. Oops. Let's go. Feels good. The Emperor protects. Well, that's enough, right? Enough is enough. Not a good spot standing, guys, really. Trust me. Come on, Rufus. You can do better than that. Much better. So this is the second time in this mission where I feel it's not going that well, but uh, so far nobody's died. And boom bada boom. Reach the extraction point, nothing I would like to do more at this point. Oh my god, come on Leandros. Correct, fantastic. Time for you to hide. Too many people I need to get rid of. And uh, not enough HP or whatever I need. It's crazy it sounds, I might just fall back. <sighs> Q 
killing. Wow. Worked like a charm. Power of suggestion, right? Let's play peekaboo here. Hello. How many of these guys are out there? Come on, Rufus. Oops, that was a brutal jump. So I'm starting to lose belief in my ability to make it past the mission. I have failed the mission before, but that was on... Uh, I fell in the conditions, the, the objectives. I don't know what happens if a space marine dies, if you get to keep him. If he's lost forever, like in Fire Emblem. That would, uh, that would definitely suck. It'd be fun, it'd be fun of course, but uh, not in the way that I wish it would have been fun. Grenade time, right? No. Hmm. I think it's time for Nathaniel to really, really shine. No, really can't hit them. Not even one of them. Oh, or he did. Okay, I see, I see, I see. Hmm, what to do, what to do. Hello. Rufus, you gotta finish the job. Seriously, you have to. That was great, so at least some good news. And... Uh, Leandros. Okay, impressive. Oh my god, another one. So by now, Hjalmar is in a pretty bad spot. Not dead. Not dying. But uh, exhausted for sure. This is a pretty long mission, right? And they do keep coming. No, not from the south. Not a tyrant guard. Whoa. I feel like there definitely has to be a trick to this mission and I'm not playing correctly. I don't know the trick though and uh... Kind of running out of energy. Maybe it's using the... Explosion points or something. God, I'm just gonna use a grenade here. I swear. Forget it, I'm gonna need you guys. Die already. Okay, that one is solved. Two more to deal with. One's up in. And Nathaniel. Flawless. So I swear, we're entrenched here, but one last round. We're gonna keep moving, because that's the only way to get out. That's the only way to make it through the mission. We're either gonna die or, or die trying. We march from the crag. 
and we shall know no fear excellent come on just bring it on So this is going to be a tyrant guard per round. And I feel like my best goal might be to um, just run it through the northern part of the map right here because I don't really see anywhere for them to come from, right? Like they can come from here, from the west, they can come from the south, here and here. But here is rock everywhere, so unless there is a turning tunnel, should be safe, right? And as we need to start moving. Why don't we do just exactly that? gun with you let's just do it it's uh, too late for anything else really anyway we're just gonna make it or not Easy as that. Welcome. No matter what, I'm going to make it. Come on. Nice. Super nice. So, um, I'm not sure that it's great to have foragers, two guys who are almost dead as foragers, but then um, one of my team is not completely dead or almost dead. Rufus. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Too bad, need to run. See you. So now Nathaniel will either shoot or just run. I, I know which one's better. Um, let's keep moving, I guess. Survive. Sorry, Ufus, I'm leaving you behind. You need to make it. I don't like what I see at all. Hey, just to make things a little bit more complicated.
Alright, let's get moving. We got a flamer body here. Seems to be super resilient to the multi melta. But uh only for a time. Yelmar. So we know the guys are here below us. Uh, there's gonna be an explosion, but there's one more Betty. I don't want to put my Space Marines at risk here. So, Overwatch. Yelmar could actually run it. Get bonus AP, get bonus AP, get bonus AP. And he does. He does a lot of free movement APs, so... Overwatch here. Nathaniel. They're really scary by now. And Rufus. Run or defend. Run or defend. Damn. Run. And turn around. We can't. Okay. The Cooler Master is working great. The iPad is only reasonably warmed up. Uh, but from the bottom it's like super super cool at least some good news nice so these guys here Definitely in a bad spot. It's like, bye bye. Don't have to worry about them anymore. This guy here, bad spot as well. So it seems to be a working strategy for the level. But we're not. We're not out of the danger zone yet. Mm, we get a welcome party here. Not good at all. Um, I really wish I could get Rufus down there, but, uh... Southpin should do the trick as well. Just trying not to get shot here. Rufus, Rufus. Oops. Here you go. And remember it. Hey, let's watch a show. Fireworks up. Next. Oh, it did not. Whoa, so it only explodes on their turn, right? I thought every time it... Um is indicated. This is a tough situation here, a very, very tough situation. Oh my god, brother going down. I'm almost sure he's gonna go down. Kill him, kill him. Now oh, it starts to feel like a space hall game, really, really desperate. Xenos from all sides. Very difficult situation. May the Emperor protect you all. What? Like, uh, no explosion? Seriously? Oh my god, everything... Everything is against us. 
So Hjalmar is 54. 54 points. It's almost dead. Practically dead. I know what we're gonna do. Really uh, too desperate at this point. We're gonna use the multi melter. We're going to use it again just because there's nothing. I don't know. We're gonna get out of the way. Okay. Sweet, sweet, sweet revenge. I actually might do something else, but whatever. Um, this is a tough situation here. Too many of the bad guys. Um, sorry, I just need to. I need to shoot them. But I can't. Um. Well, the plasma weapon weapon is overheated twice. It's doubly overheated, so Nathaniel needs to run. Oh my god, this is a bad situation. By all means, definitions and just not good. Die. Just die. Okay. The Emperor protects. And Zelpian does as well. So I, I still foster a little bit of hope. I hope that wasn't Helmar. Very, very. T I'm very tense here, guys. <laughs> I know. I, I know you're probably eating popcorn, but I'm um, very tense. Very, very long mission. Don't want to repeat it. Don't want to lose any space marines. I'm having fun though. Um, absolutely having fun. Um, it's time to hope for the best. Elmar, dude. You got a kill here. Um, I'm afraid they'll come from the south. There's uh, very little for me to do. Kill him. Don't take any chances. <laughs> Whoa, Roof is standing in the danger zone. Uh, we need to get him out. That will leave us without enough action points to make a shot. And I just saw a turn guard. Not something I wanted to see. Um, that's too bad. Die. Okay, that seems to have worked nicely throughout this mission. Whenever I say die, they just uh, oblige. But I just need to say survive. 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 I'm going to hypnotize you to do that. So I got a couple questions. If I quit the mission, 
what happens. Uh, do my space marines live? I'm going to be like super angry, super, super angry if I lose these guys. I don't know, I mean, just a bad situation, right? I honestly have no idea what to do. I'm stuck. I need to get rid of these guys, especially those who are able to do not miss. God damn it. Hmm. Hmm. So. Yalmar. I'm going to put you in danger. Done. Now you need to kill the other one as well. You need to do that. You only have one action point left. You need to kill him. No. Nope. I'm going to hide. I'm going to kill him. I'm going to hide. God, I so don't know what I want. Kill, 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 kill. Keep at it. Somebody, anybody, shoot. Shoot him out. Blast him off. Super long video, super long mission here. Very, very tiptoed burn heretics. Not quite what I needed. So I'm super tiptoed here. Turn it on everywhere. Die. All right. All right, so there's one guy we need to get rid of, but can't see him, unfortunately. Oh, we still can't see him. Fantastic. Just fantastic. What to do, what to do. Or watch here. You're going to move out because if he runs in, he's going to explode. We know that. Or watch here. This is getting trickier. We need to kill this guy. And we need not to get our um, gun overheated. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Making really slow progress here. Things are nasty. Just one word nasty. TM. Die. Alright. Oh my god, Rufus hit. That's bad. Let's, let's just not deny it, right? Explode. Explode. Well, didn't do much. Oh, the extraction zone is... Um, 
booby trap. That's great. <sighs> what to do? What to do? I just need to run for it. I'm sorry. It's like nothing else to do here, really. Seriously. <clears throat> Can I make it? I don't know. Or watch. I don't know, really. It's, uh, should I try and kill these guys? Should I? What if I don't kill them? What if I run off ammo? Uh, if I run, what if they shoot me in the back? God damn it. Oh my god, there's another one. Clear side of Rufus. I'm just gonna waste them. Xenos, filth, mutant, heretic, die. You know, not my lucky day. Alright, but just because you guys are friends. Oops. No, no friends, sorry. <laughs> oh my god, this is gonna be crazy yet. Keep running, buddy. Whoa, super. <laughs> At least something, right? Extraction zone on fire, that's this is splendid. All right, so. What can we do? We gotta kill this guy and keep running. Die. Bloody die. Okay. Hmm. What a puzzle. We definitely don't want to deal with this guy. Maybe we do, I don't know. And over he did, super. Just what I needed to see here, or whatever. Yeah, but uh, I shouldn't have rushed in. Uh, yeah, I shouldn't have rushed in. Well, whatever, too late. We got two moves here. And Overwatch. Hey, we got a buddy. Rufus is just do one move and Overwatch. Or run it. Let's risk it. Let's be crazy. I don't care. Kill him. Or just carry him away, that's gonna work as well. Oops. Hey. That wasn't fair. Miss. 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 So, I'm doomed. There's uh, no question about this, I'm completely doomed. 
very little I can do to succeed in this mission. I can get drastically lucky. But uh, can I can I bet on it? Can I count on it? No. It's too bad here. All right. No, 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 don't, 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 don't. Just too bad here. Four points. Are you crazy? Bad. No matter what I do, too bad. Can we just uh, talk it out? Too bloody bad. <sighs> so the problem is this guy. All the other guys can run it. And that's what I'm doing. Not playing the hero anymore. Well guys, so this is the moment of truth. I may lose anywhere between one all of my space marines this turn so fingers crossed hmm. didn't work out and it's the big one that comes next perfect Oh my god, how many of them are there? Don't shoot, don't shoot. That has to be, that has to be like one HP. This is super tight. Boom. Oh my god, another one. Roof is uh, relatively strong in terms of health compared to Yaris. We need to get to a point where we can just run it. You die right now. I just don't know. This guy, Helmar, he's got 41 health. He needs to kill whatever's coming at him. And Nathaniel. Well, I can try not to overheat, or I can do one overheat shot. Not easy. Let me take the chance here. Oh my god. One round for extraction. Please do survive. <laughs> this is a good thing. Die, 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 die. Shoot again, shoot again, shoot again. I swear to God, shoot again. 
And he's down. Oh my god. Hilmar is down. Uh, probably my most advanced space marine level 4 champion space wolf. There's no denying it, he's down, he's, he's gone. And I can't end the mission, so that's a double bummer, by all means. Um, complete bummer here, like seriously. Leandros might be going down as well. Kill him. Alright, we got more guys here. That's exciting. And Nathaniel, Overwatch. <clears throat> bad situation, bad news. And uh, Hilmar dead. It's completely bad news, by all means. If that Tyrion shoots, Leandros might be, or Rufus might be leaving us. What a situation. Hilmar is now in Valhalla with uh, songs being sung about him. That's uh, one way to look at it. And uh, boom. Well, let's put a tail between our legs. Just run. Let's not pretend anything here. This has been a disastrous mission. It's taken a long time. I should figure out faster about the northern escape. But that's life, I guess. So, no experience for Hjalmar, as uh, expected by... Is he alive? Let's find out. Multigun, very exciting. Pack of cards, very exciting as well. But, uh... Is my space marine alive? Is all that I want to know. Because that are going to make or break my day. It's the end of day here. Seven minutes after midnight. Very thrilling. Let's see. Hilmar is still there. Um, fantastic news. So, unlike Fire Emblem, the game will not brutally punish you if you lose Space Marine. Right now, I'm happy. It would have been, uh, it would have made for a very interesting mechanic. But right now, I'm super happy about that. Let's open the pack and hope we get some real badass there. Or uh, ultimate weapon. Whoa! Met Krager, um plasma pistol. That's really, really nice for ultramarines. We got ultramarine apothecary, so we can stop using Zopian, who is a son of the devil himself. And wolf tooth necklace. I have no idea what it does. All right, interesting. Practical makes you invincible for a turn. That's it, guys. Thank you for watching the show. Um, do subscribe. I'm very happy to take some more name suggestions. Zibanzun has suggested name Nathaniel, so we've renamed one of our Space Marines file of his fault to Nathaniel Fistfall. Keep them coming, and I'll keep them remain. Uh, re keep renaming them. 
Um, see you next time.